Families, businesses, and even local governments are feeling the impacts of COVID-19. News 10 Bureau Chief Gary Bryant tells us how Knox County is preparing for the financial impact while still moving forward with investments. Knox County has completed its budget. Like many other things this year, COVID-19 played a big part. For businesses in Knox County, the impacts of COVID-19 are being felt right now. But those impacts have a trickle-down effect for county government. What we wanted to do was to take the effects of the COVID and try to spread it out over two years, 2021 and 2022. The reason we did that is because um, 2022 will really be a rough year. Local government sees the impact in terms of less income taxes and gas taxes. Knox County unofficially made its budget a two-year budget. While they can only submit for 2021, they have already made plans for 2022. Those plans don't change much financially. However, there are investments planned. We're continuing to make investments in roads in the county. One road in particular is uh, at the uh, industrial park. And we're making investments in industrial development as well with our uh, KCDC. The 2021 budget has officially been passed on to the state for approval. But as days turn into months, COVID-19 will still play a big role in what comes next. Uh, the unfortunate answer is the potential impact is unlimited. I mean, we still don't know. County leaders say they plan to continue their investment in the recently completed Pantheon Business Incubator. Working from home in Vincennes, Gary Bryan, News 10.